guess what time it is? It's time to go live. How did I do this? Hi. I close it. Okay, I think it's working. Can you guys see me or can you not see me? Hello. I actually can't see it, so I'm gonna have to put on my glasses. They're really super dirty. But are you guys ready to unbox some BB stuff? As soon as I get my glasses on. Okay. Hi, it's 2 p.m. It's 11 a.m. here though. Yes. Okay, good. And is it blurry? Okay, good. Can see you. Sorry, I'm blind. <laughs> okay, good. So we're gonna give everyone like a couple of seconds to join. Thank you. I was just on Jason's live stream. He's just on right now. Yeah, he just goes live. I said hi to him. Hi, Eddie. Here he runs. Hi, Trevor. Nope. You can't see me. <laughs> hi, Dylan. BRB. Okay, hi. Hi, Isabella. Okay. Hi, love fish. Oh, hi, Lindsay. <laughs> yeah, Thank you, Kitty. Worry. Yes. Hi, Babies Bunnies and Dove from Minneapolis. Amber, Derek. I don't know what Derek means. Okay, so let's see what time it is, actually. So can, I love all you guys, too. <laughs> let's get a tour of the room. It's not a very good tour of the room. Um, hold on, I'll show you. Like, it's just basically all my crap everywhere. <laughs> There's two beds. It's nice. Not, like, super nice. But, I mean, like, I guess this is all about this stuff. All this stuff. Hi, Indiana. I finally learned what goat meant. I thought people were calling me a goat. Um, why didn't you keep Kevin as an alliance member? Sorry, I'm trying to read these all. So, Joey, Alex, H. Man. And then all these towels, because I just took a shower. <laughs> Pensacola, Florida. Hi. It's two from Humiston, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. What's the weather like out there? I miss it. I love the eagles. I love that you love the eagles. I don't live in a hotel room. <laughs> I'm just on vacation. Where's T? T is at the venue. We're going to go see, fire, uh, see Foo Fighters. Hi from Washington. Hi from Montreal. Whose zing was your favorite? I really liked Mark's. Because, you know, bisexual. Deborah. Never know if I Paul. I'm sorry, King Keaton, that I made you sad. It's not NPA. I, what? Do you think we're going to like someone's been speaking on the next one like Paul did? I don't think so because it's going to be celebrity. So they might. They might bring someone back. I'm not in Vegas. Hi from Kentucky. You should do a YouTuber. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, big boobs. I don't know how you can see my boobs, so I'm going to disregard that. I love the food bars. Yes, I'm going to go see them today. So, or tomorrow, I think. Say hi to Derek, my husband. Oh, hi, Derek. I was like, who's Derek? I don't know. Like, Derek from, like, season 16. Thank you. Okay, so is everyone here? Is everyone ready? How do you feel that Paul lost? I feel sad because, you know, someone has to lose. It's, it's not a good thing when someone loses. But, you know, second place is not losing, in my opinion. I would have loved second place. Are you a fan of Robert Patterson? Like, from, like, Twilight? <laughs> You're welcome. The UK, how cool. How can I follow who? The real um, NorCal. Like Sacramento NorCal? Nice tips. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to start this because everyone's getting kind of like super awkward and weird. So I got a box from CBS and it showed me all the stuff for Big Brother. If you guys keep writing, I will not be able to see it. I'm going to tell you 100% right now. I'll try and look, but I'm super blind. Okay, so I'm going to start showing you guys some of the stuff that I got in my BB box. Um, one of the things that I got was this number one card, and it says, Who Said We're the Revengers? And it's from the last BB Comics, um, HOH that Josh won. So that's kind of cool. I have a whole bunch of these, but, um, I took them out at home because I totally forgot. So I'm sorry. Super sorry about that. So that's one of the things. Hello. I know my sister's probably watching, so hi, Drea. And then, um, I'll start with kind of like some of the easier stuff. So this is one of the cups that I got. It's an official BB cup, and I never put my name on it. We were playing pool one day, and Kevin hit um, my cup, and he knocked it off the table and caused this giant crack in it. It's so random. But he asked me if I wanted to switch cups because he broke mine, and I didn't because, like, I really love this cup. It's, like, my favorite. We also got one of these cool thermals that says Big Brother. And let's see. It's pretty cool. I haven't used mine yet. I think this, the note's still inside from the show. I was like one of the only people who didn't use any of my cups because I wanted to save them for afterwards. Um, I got another one of these sippy cups that's kind of like random. I'm good. Sorry. And then thanks. Nice cup. <laughs> Cuphead. All right. Say hi to Jean. Hi, Jean and Quinn. Thank you. And this is my other coffee mug that Cody stole from me and wrote his name on. You can see it with the nail polish where he tried to steal my cup. Um, I also got a Big Brother bowl. I think um, Paul has a matching one to mine because I think they only had a couple of these, so he has the other one of these. And that would be all my bowls and my cups. 
I don't know if you guys remember the second Candy Crush, like, um, HOH on the 16th that Paul won, but this is from it also. These are one of the golden tickets that you needed that, um, to throw one of those balls. They were placed inside these type of balls with a slit, and you had to cut them open and, like, look inside for them. Yes, I'm keeping this stuff. Push her, I cut is so hard. Yeah, that's true. I was struggling. People, I ever perverse. Yes, that's true, too. Hi, Andy. Um, so when I was playing that one, I broke open one of these and I used this and I made it super sharp and I was cutting into these balls and making them like candy shivs. Like, so that was pretty intense for that one. Um, I think you guys might remember this from day 53 from the Outback Steakhouse. This is one of those things that we were catapulting and like dropping on that map where I came in second. Hi guys. Speak Portuguese. Un falo un poco de Portuguese. And I don't know a little Portuguese, <laughs> but that's the only thing I do know. So some other stuff that was in here, I think a lot of people are confused, but nobody was making fun of me when they sent me this. This is actually my doll from CBS. This is my voodoo doll from the, uh, I think it's the second temptation. So it would have been day 17th where Christmas won it. Oh shoot, my glasses fell off. Yeah, so Christmas won this temptation. It was the second temptation and um, that's it, day 17. Is your reading for you on Jesus bag? Thank you. Aren't you? No, your voice sounds so much different. Uh, my voice sounds different because we were always talking so much, so my voice is a lot more, I guess, high pitched and annoying in real life. It's just because it's been so straight in the house because we were always doing like, you know, DRs and stuff like that, so you couldn't ever hear me. And um, the next step I got up is a poison apple. This one I think is from uh, the first HOH, so day three when we had to hook them to like our belt and stuff, that's where these ones come from. This thing's very ugly and very sad. I'm not a fan of these apples. Let's see. And then this is my safe token from day one when I opened my, um, where we did that trapeze thing and I opened my apple and it was safe. What is this about? I have no reference for that question. Indonesia. So I've been to Des Despinar. I think that's in Indonesia. It's from Bali. I've been there before. So hi from Bali. Go Eagles! <laughs> what are you going to do with all that stuff? I don't know. Um, probably hang out. I like hang a lot of it because I like a lot of this stuff. So like, this is my um, starfish and the starfish competition, and I think that was on day ten, the first POV. Yay! <laughs> I don't know why people are being creepy. I honestly don't. I can't. I can't help with that stuff. So let's see what other things I have. I have one of these peas from the last, um, we had, or actually it's not a pea, it's a lime. We had to drop them in that like thing where I won the last HOH, maybe you're the last one. Sucks. But just a couple of things that I have. So this is my ballerina costume, my ballet shoes, um, my tutu, actually, all that stuff over there. I have like the weird like leotard thing that have, like that weird leotard thing, but like, like I left that at home. Um, these two are from day 46. Who remembers Otev? Yeah, I took 16 and one because 16 players and one because number one, duh. <laughs> so this is from day, I think 44 when Josh won the golf tournament. Yeah, Alex, there it is. I love pink. So they gave me pink. Yeah. So this is his. This is from the terminal POV. So I think that's, um, that was Paul's first HOH, and he went on the 16th, so this is day 18. We did that, like, travel touristy thing, and I had to wear this. This is from Punch Kick Slap. So that's me, myself, and I. And Bobby sent me this to remember him from that me, myself, and I kick slap punch one. So that's super cool. I do not, I like hot dogs, actually. <laughs> and this is my cop costume from day, what day was that? I think 30, so this is the HOH, but it was actually like day 31 because we did it like midnight, so it was pretty rough. So that's my cop costume. This is my squirrel one from my HOH POV. So this is when we did that, that um, Temple of Temptation where I had to walk back and forth on that beam. I think it was like uh, day 17, because I went on this, no, no, that's wrong. I'm sorry, it's day 24, this is day 24. I don't remember what competition this was in. Some blue one. <laughs> So let's see. This is my hide and go veto shirt. You didn't really see me in that episode because I was in the pool because I was not competing or doing anything. Poor Christmas had to stand there with her foot and she was all 
hot and melting and all the other people were. So yeah, Alex, that's my POV one. Um, this is day, I think, 58, we're the first double eviction. So this is when they were doing the shuffleboard thing and I just had to shuffle it all. How do you remember all the days these days are from? It was part of the game because I thought I was going to make it to the end. So I needed to make sure I knew all the dates. So I, I probably wear the cop costume for Halloween, but I was thinking of actually making my wiener woman costume a thing. This is from High and Go Vito too. I took a whole bunch of the pool floaties. Uh, Big Brother sent me some towels. That's a cool towel. Big Brother. And then, sorry. So I got two of these towels. That's really cool. Everyone remembers my Camp Adventures tours. Here's my hat, my scarf. This is my outdoors if I wanted to go in the pool outfit, which is not very pool-like. And then this is my daytime outfit, which I was supposed to wear like when I was doing regular stuff. And everyone remembers BB Comics. This is my cape and my t-shirt. And last but not least, my Wiener Woman comic book. And the difference in my comic was I had different colored ketchup. I think it was black or red or something. And I don't, I'm not sure if this is the right one or not the right one. <laughs> oh, here. Let's see. Ah! Okay, sorry. I sat on something. Let's see. I have to go get ready, but let me spend like five minutes with you guys and see what kind of questions and stuff we are. 11 11, big wish. Okay, so let's see. How many times did they make you make cock toss? I think it was 14 if I was right. The hot dog woman. Yeah, I want to be wiener woman. I want to be wiener What? I want to be wiener woman, so I have to make that costume if I do. Did Raven do a cartwheel on her eviction? Kevin was right, bitch. Oh, that's really nice. Thank you, Randy. No, I haven't spoken to Paul yet. I just haven't had very much time. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello from Georgia. Heels or flats? I'm um, going out. Heels. Every day. Flats. Bonjour. Pivots. I don't know what you mean. Why does everyone want to know if I like Chipotle? I like Freebirds better than Chipotle. In all honesty. Hello. Eagles from New Jersey. Oh, okay. I used to live near Bristol, so I used to live kind of near that. Do in the house. Favorite thing to do in the house, hello, is probably tweeze my eyebrows. It's the most interesting thing when you're not talking to people. Hello from Canada. I know that's boring. I don't know what that means. Thank you from Indiana. I think this is Haley. Melissa. BB, you have to be really interesting. Like my advice for auditioning is just be like really super interesting. Be yourself. Tell really good stories. Have good lighting. Be interesting. Take it somewhere like I think like for Raven she like went to like her sign and showed how many people like actually live there and there's not a lot. She wanted to drink Coke the whole time. Yeah, I did want to drink Coke the whole time. Please say hi, Avery. Hi, Avery! I remember I called you. Is that you who called me? That's right. Mom's watching. Hi, Tony! Uh, I don't know what the rest of that says. I knew a couple of people's votes on what they were going to vote for, but what I was really depending on was how they answered the questions, and I liked how Josh addressed everything in his. I saw you said hi to Jason. I said hi to you. Is he live? Is Jason live right now? Via? Via your sister? Oh, okay. Hi. Please come tell you an Eagles game. I think I might be going to the 12-10 um, Eagles versus Rams game, so that might be a thing. Hi, I think, hey, hey Mike, oh, I recognize that one, <laughs> bye Alex, bye Mike, and that's pretty much it, does anyone have one last minute question, that's my question, loved, <laughs> I, I think me and Jason should do Amazing Race, but I want him to have like time at home, hi William, Auntie loves you, Thank you for me being your favorite player. Actually, it, was, it wasn't ex exactly how I expected. It was a lot of, t like, sitting. Like, I thought they would have, like, more things, like, behind the scenes to just kind of, like, let you, like, wait and stuff because you don't see a lot of stuff. But, no, you literally just sit there. Even I can sing, but not right now. My voice is too scratchy. I am 29 year, or 28. I'm going to be 29 um, December 20th with Christmas, and she'll be 36. Since she's released that. 
hello. Can I take you to lunch? Sure, where are you? Will you marry me? Okay. <laughs> What's the first thing you asked about after the first thing you asked about? It was about my, my nephew, William. I wanted to know how he was and I called my family. Hi, Indonesia. I'll probably be there soon. My bikinis are actually, actually, you know what? I have one of my bikinis. You guys wait, I'll grab it. Okay, so I do actually have one of my bikinis here. It's not a bikini, this is one of my one pieces, but I'm not wearing it, but this is one of my samples I made. It's a one piece Sazelle. I have a lot of alterations to do on it, but this is like the front kind of like type of thing, and then I have to get some other stuff done. But yeah, that's one of my bikinis. Or actually bathing suits. Very cool, Chloe and Mark. Yes, I actually went with Mark and Elena and Jason to the wrap party. Hi, Indonesia. Let's go Packers. Probably not. Yeah, Christmas actually texted me today. So I told her I would text her after I was done with this. So after this, I'm going to text her. Hi, Mac. Um, favorite things about the house is that the food was always stocked. That's It was best. Wear your camp counselor outfit. <laughs> Are you Filipino? Yes, I'm Hawaiian, Spanish, Portuguese, Irish, Chinese, Korean, and Filipino. And then my sister did her 23 and me, and she realized we're Japanese also. New Orleans would be awesome. We were talking about going there. Right now, I'm currently not employed, but I used to be a customer service marketer, or, um, marketing coordinator for Maddie Bird Products. And I'm actually not sour. Are you mad, bro? Seems like you are. I'm doing good. I do like Italy. I went there one time when I was a little, when I was a kid. I don't have my pants to do the camp counselor. And it's an adventure guide. Let's see. Bestie. <laughs> like, the people who are being mean, like, why are you here? You're so lame. Go to work or something. Should have moved to Italy. No, I like them. <laughs> okay, yeah. Here's my camp counselor. Alley. I love you too. My favorite comp all... Hi, Gwen! <laughs> my favorite comp was obviously all the wall comps because those ones were great. Thank you, Michael. My favorite video game at all time series has to be Bioshock. That's my favorite one. And then also I like um, Silent Hill and like Resident Evil. I like scary ones, but I like playing Call of Duty Zombies. So Zombies in Raveland, Zombies in Spaceland, Thank you. Open, open jacket. I'm wearing a shirt. <laughs> um, my biggest regret would probably be trusting Paul so much and not listening to Jason when he told me like that he was not trustworthy. I definitely would. No, I can't pronounce. I'm sorry. Hi, Katie. Hi, Nick. And then creepy dude, of course. There's so many creeps in the world. Can you shout to Natalia? Hi, Natalia. Yay, camper. This is my nightmare. I don't even care anymore. Like, honestly, like, now that we're out of the game, like, I have no hate for anyone. Like, literally, I'm so happy to be out of the house and just have, like, all these opportunities and, like, get to live life. And, like, the house just makes you realize, like, how um, you don't have a lot of stuff to do, like, and how much of your life you should be doing stuff. And by the way, I just realized I forgot a whole bunch of stuff. I forgot there was a bunch more things on here I wasn't paying attention. Um, there's this guy who's a huge fan of the show, and he made this each of these shirts. So mine says Alex on the back. I think it's backwards for you. But it has all the characters, and he drew them all himself with marker. I'm up here in the corner. There's Jason and Jillian. And that's the shirt. I'm sorry I forgot that. I need to send him a thank you card because this is amazing. And then um, I got a cast signed photo by everyone. I'm pretty sure everyone signed it. Yeah. Everyone signed it. <laughs> Hi, Taylor. And shout out to Dominic or Dominique. I'm not sure. Big Brother season. Jobin. Go away. No one likes you here. Cody. Cody's actually pretty nice. Thank you for Portugal. And last but not least, this is actually the last step, is my key and this. I love it. Hi, Dakota. What? Hi, Dakota. 
What? I don't know what that means. Canada! Hi, Canada! Hi, Mark! Yay! I can't believe I'm wearing this again. I think I'll probably, at some point, probably put these on and like post them on Instagram. But right now, I'm just like, uh, dying. Do you miss buying with me? No. No, I don't. <laughs> I do not. I do not miss fighting with Mark. I actually do miss everyone, though. Your life is complete. Well, that's good. And I'm late, but it's okay because I want to see you. Load all the pillows. <laughs> Hi, Alina. Did you like your comic? Yeah, actually, like, out of all of them, I actually really liked mine. Hi, Ryan. Did you learn there's the big brother house? Um, the first day you're kind of nervous, but after that, it was just like, is over. So, do you miss me? Yes, I do miss you. I'm kind of blind, though. These aren't my good glasses. I lost them in the house. Life is not back to normal for me. People keep running into me and saying, like, like taking pictures and stuff. Um, I got my box of stuff, I think, on Wednesday. But it's just because I'm closest to them so that's kind of default and I think Jillian got hers yesterday too my favorite sports football to watch not to play NFL football though not college why did you win room the biggest man hi Emily show your armpit that's weird what kind of power does he have in it I serve up justice one wiener at a time official Dre hi hi Alex Vance <laughs> hi Eric don't give in to the haters where do you get your sports bras? Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret has the best sports bras ever. And that's like pretty much all I wore on the season. But maybe I'll make those in the future. Okay, so I think I am going to get off now. I don't remember. There's like a whole bunch of stuff that people told me to say on it, but I don't remember. Oh, maybe I'll send people. I have like a whole bunch of these tickets. This is how many tickets I had for that thing. I had a billion. Turn haters into motivators. <laughs> Guess what I'm about to go get. What are you about to get? No! They want Mermaid Hair so bad. It's amazing. One week at a time. Yes, please text me a pic. I bet it's going to be awesome. I want to see that. How long do you need to get it, Elena? Actually, you know what? I'm not going to make this about us. Just chatting. Sorry. Say hi, Blake. Hi, Blake. And I'm going to go get ready for the concert. Open. Hi. Open what? Hello. Are those tickets from Candy Crush? Yes, these are the tickets from Candy Crush. Hi, Ashley. Okay, thanks, Elena, because I definitely want to see what that looks like. Mermaid hair is going to be awesome. Yeah, these are those. Hi, Max Wayman. Mm -hmm. Bye. I'm going to get, I'm going to go now. So, yes, I watched Rick and Morty. I just saw the new season, and that was freaking amazing. <laughs> I'm a huge Rick and Morty fan, but... I'm also a huge, 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 huge fan. If you watch both of them side by side, they have a lot of similar things. So I'm a Futurama fan first. But hi, Casey.